Hi friends, welcome to GT Coding. In this video, we are going to learn about Google Fonts. So, whenever you are designing a new web page, you always uh, need to have a great looking font. So, there are different resources where you can download fonts from, but this is a great resource which is called Google Fonts, where you don't have to download anything. You can directly insert a code in your HTML or CSS and access the font. So let's just talk about the interface right here. So here you have all the fonts listed and you can see all the preview over here. And here you can select different types of fonts. So for example, if you want to have only serif fonts, you can deselect all the others and all the serif fonts will appear over here if you want sans serif you can select that and all the sans serif fonts will appear over here you can also set the sorting to different types you can also select the languages there are a lot of languages over here and uh, then we have all these different options where you can um, change these things and you can get the fonts that you want for example if you want the thickness to be a lot higher you can change this and uh, and you can get the required font now if you want to have a font that you already know you can search right here so we will search a font called lato so we can see we have this lato font over here and if we click on this uh, link over here we can see we get the full specification of this font and we get the details of this font all the styles that we have in this font and uh, we also have an example of a paragraph and a heading another awesome thing is that you can type over here and see how it looks with this font so we will type welcome to gt coding so this is how this font will look like so in this way you can select the font that you want now we'll go back and uh, so you can scroll through these fonts and find a font that you like and uh, for my case i will uh, use this font which is called roboto and I will click on this select this font button over here and when I click this button you can see we have one font selected if you want you can download this font by clicking on this download button and you can use it offline but if you want to use your font for a web design you can use these lines of code or this line of code over here and you can use these fonts right away uh, let me select one more font so I will go over here and look for another font so we have another font over here called Ubuntu I will add this font also in my list so I will click on this button over here select this font and we can see we have two fonts selected and we can also see the loading time of this font so it says that it is fast so we don't we don't need to worry about anything if we use a lot of fonts then it will uh, affect our performance so if we select all these fonts and now if we see our loading time we can see it is moderate so we will use less fonts so we will delete all these fonts and we will use these two fonts Ubuntu and Roboto now I'm going to show you how to use these fonts in our web page so the first method is using the HTML file so you have to copy this line of code over here we'll select and copy this this is our web page we need to go to our index.html and uh, paste this right here so we will we will paste this line of code over here now we can use this font in our CSS 
so we'll go to our CSS and in our body and here we will access the font so we will type Roboto and sans serif for uh, a backup font and if we save this file we can see the font changes over here so so this is how you can use the google web fonts if you want to use the other font you just have to type the name of the other font right here ubuntu and we have that font over here so this is how you can use the google web fonts uh, it is free to use you don't have to pay anything it is free to use for commercial purposes as well so you can go to google fonts web page and uh, use those fonts the next um, method is using the css link so here we have an option called import so in this we will just copy this line of code and uh, we will paste it right here in our CSS so for that we don't need to have this line of code in the HTML so we will delete this and we can see we have this font right here so in this way you can use the Google fonts so there are two different uh, methods in which you can use you can use the the HTML link or the CSS import property so I hope that you have understood how to use Google fonts in your web page so if you like this video please click on the like button and uh, share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel to get the latest updates so thanks a lot for watching have a nice day